Jenny, welcome to my channel, Jennifer Perez Art, and today we're going to tackle organizing, making whatever's going to be in your home to spark joy out of you. So now we are what I call in the fun drawer. It's not costumes, lady. It's not costumes. Don't get those kind of thoughts. It's bikini and swimsuit area. I love the bikinis I have. I have I think I have four pairs of bikinis and a black swimsuit and that's what I, I like to like entertain the um, the colors and stuff like that so it seems like you have more bikinis and for me right now that's more than sufficient I don't need any more and there's such little pieces of clothing that you can even have more of them but I do want to make a crochet bikini that I would love 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 to make so if you guys want to see how I make my crochet bikini let me know in the comments below Okay, let's begin with the bottom part of the bikini, just like we did in the panties videos. If you guys didn't watch that, I will leave you the link down below. But what I'm basically going to do is kind of hide the tie backs if it has some, and then I'm going to bring both sides in, just like so. Hide the little tie backs, like I said, and then you're going to bring the crotch area, fold it like over, just like you see, flip it, and then right in between these two gaps, you are going to tuck in the crotch area. And this is really simple as just like you saw. And you're just gonna keep folding away all your bikinis and pile them up. Now the top part of the bikini, I fold it in half, boob to boob side, <laughs> get the straps, tie them, make a bow, whatever you'd like, and then tuck them in between both and if you have one like this, even if it's um, not tied, just go ahead and tie it and hide the gaps, the stramps, right in between them. Now, this is one that has a cup. These are very flexible, so I can cup it in to one another. And I don't want all these straps hanging around, so I'm going to hide them away in between the booby cups. <laughs> just like so. one piece swimsuit hide the straps inside fold the crotch area upwards now i have this on the bed laying belly side down so once it's folded over i'm going to flip it right over now this has cups so it's kind of uncomfortable but what you're going to do is just try to hide the rest of the material just on top of it and you can tuck these away just like so now let's move on to the the dresses that you go over your bikinis. Now this one is kind of wide at the very bottom. So what I'm going to do is just fold in into right into the material as if they were two two triangles and then fold in thirds and then you're going to flip this over in thirds again very easy if you didn't get it go ahead and rewind and watch it again this is the little little scarf skirt thing i have no idea what this is called it's just like a cover-up just fold it in half this has like the little tie thingamajig on the side bring it in just like so and they're gonna fold it downwards and upwards this is like the folding in thirds and then Tuck it away and get those wrinkles out of there. And then I'm going to roll it up very easily and this will stand up. If you have various of them, they will all fit all together. So here's another cover-up dress that I sometimes wear. This one is not see-through that I can walk around downtown areas where the beaches are here in Puerto Rico. So you're going to fold it in thirds as you saw. Oh, first you fold the, the top part, right? You fold it in and then in thirds and then flip this over and fold again in thirds. And this just makes like nice little bundles that will stand up alone. Here's another cover up, semi transparent. I will wear this around there when I'm going to the beach. And it's really windy, as you can tell. This is kind of fluffy at the, um, at the wrist area. So just 
work slowly and kind of accommodate it towards the front. Stretch out the bottom. And you're going to fold this in thirds. So bring it over once, upwards and downwards, twice. And we are going to fold it almost all the way to the very end. And then once and twice. And this will firmly stand up. So if you have beach towels, I have this only beach towel since I do not like to have many things around. This one is sufficient for right now. So basically, it's really easy to do. You're going to do it two ways. This is the folded way. If you didn't catch that, go ahead and rewind. It's very easy. And the second way is way easier if you like. This will even fit in your, in your beach bag. So you're just rolling it up after you had folded it in thirds. Here's the finished drawer. As you can see, I have everything fit in here and I have extra space. In the description box, I will leave you the links to all the social media you can find me on the internet. I'm on Facebook, Instagram as Jennifer Perez Art. I'm here on YouTube as Jennifer Perez Art. On Snapchat and Twitter, I'm on as Jennifer Perez JP. You guys subscribe to my channel here on YouTube at Jennifer Perez Art and I will see you soon. Take care and have a wonderful day. Ciao.